We're back out in the Black Mountains after waiting three days for heavy rain and possible thunderstorms to go by. Today we were promised sunshine until three, four o'clock and some rain showers from five into like six, then heavy rain at seven and then just cloud. That's when we left home. Now we've got here, the forecast has changed. We are now expecting light rain from three o'clock, just gone three o'clock and it's lightly raining. Uh, heavy rain from five and then fog. So I guess we just made the best of it. Got Linda with me again. So I won't uh, film an enormous amount as we get up the hill because I don't want to get the camera too wet. Uh, yeah, so I'll catch up with you in a bit. Well, I think we've lucked out on the ridge we chose. If you look over there, that's uh, Penegader Vauer up to Weinvach. That ridge is all flagged in until you get right to the end. And looking the other way, that's the Offa's Dyke Ridge, where I walked with Darren a few weeks ago, and that's all flagged in as well. So I think we're about halfway to where we want to go. And the rain's holding off for us at the moment, but it doesn't look very good behind. The wind's almost non-existent, so it's taking its time to catch us up. But We'll see. Here we had 10 tours going past us down on Dartmoor a few weeks ago. DV up in the Black Mountains. They did spend an awful long time trying to work out which way to go. When you think there's only the one path here. <laughs> so I'm not sure how hard that was, but anyway, good luck lads. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Good, good. So, it's proper clagged in now. No. no I doubt we're going to get any views. No. Uh, certainly won't be uh, time lapse in the sunset, I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> or sunrise right. in the morning. <laughs> On my last video, I did a time lapse of the sunset and I put a bit of music over the top. It was music from Purple Planet. And you're supposed to put a, a line in the description, you know, at, attributing the music to Purple Planet, and I forgot. So the video has been copyrighted, <laughs> which uh, is not like a strike against the channel, as long as I deal with it. So last time that happened, I deleted the video and put it back in. But what I've done this time is I put the attribution in and then disputed the copyright and we'll see what happens. Worst comes to the worst. It's not a very well performing video at the moment, so have to take it down it won't be a great loss but we'll see <laughs> quite a few horses about yeah oh, so we got a view i wasn't expecting go have a look so here we are the northern escarpment to the black mountains it's Tumpa over there, England in the far distance, Herefordshire, as you can see. Then in the valley is all, all is well. Carries on up that way. So we were hoping to pitch here somewhere. We'll go look for a pitch, I'll let you know. Oh dear. Well that was good timing. <laughs> yeah, we just got the tent up. As you can hear, it's raining. Yeah. If we were expecting it. Five-ish. Five-ish, yeah. it's just half five now. Yeah. So we're just uh, sheltering. I'll tell you what, mm -hmm. you don't put the inner up, there's about five acres of space <laughs> in there, isn't there. Yeah. Ridiculous. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Anyway, she's up. We're in. We're dry. We're dry, we're just sort of 
what we're going to do. It's supposed to rain for a couple of hours yeah. like this. Have a cup of coffee. Yeah, and put the kettle on. Yeah. And uh, sort ourselves out. We just sort of slung everything in, really. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I've had to go out and adjust the tent a bit. Sorry, I've got to shout so you can hear me. <laughs> oh dear. You're not even wet. No, I haven't been out adjusting the tent tonight. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, never mind. So we're just waiting for the rain to ease off in what, an hour and a half? So we might get some tea on soon then. Do you want to swap positions and do the cooking just for a change? No. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Alright, I'll, I'll do the cooking again now. Okay, so tonight's dinner we've got some peri peri chicken, which I've taken out of its plastic thing because it wouldn't fit in anything. And peri peri rice. Plus What's that? Um, dried onion. Crunchy onion. Crunchy fried onion, isn't it? Yeah, crunchy fried um, onion. Is that if we need it? We might not need it. Some rich and deep flavour reduced salt chicken oxide stuff. So, you see how we go on. See how we go on. That's going to start burning. Mm -hmm. yeah. You dig it. You know, and then you go back. <laughs> And a burnt tin. Bitter. Mmm. Just a spicy. So. So. Yesterday <laughs> was your birthday. I was 408. <laughs> Plus a bit. <laughs> we had planned to be out Friday night into Saturday, haven't we? Originally. Yeah. But the weather was awful. So we're a little bit late. But. There's only one thing to be done. <laughs> <laughs> My birthday cake. Oh, it is homemade. Yeah. Oh, I should have got a light now. Oh, oh and it lights. How long have you got to wait? Oh, it goes down to bed. <laughs> <laughs> so? So, I'm not going gonna gonna to... You're not going to sing happy birthday? I'm not going to sing on camera, but I wish you a happy belated birthday for yesterday. <laughs> oh. You don't want to hear me sing, I tell you. No, it's true. <laughs> Am I, can, can I blow it out? Yeah? You can blow it out. Huh? Do I have to wish? Of course. You wish know what I'm going to wish for. Rain to stop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There we go. There we go. Now I can eat me eat me muffin. Blueberry muffins made by the fair hand of Linda. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> walk into the guy rope. That'll do. Still raining. It's easing off a lot now, so we're starting to get uh, some some better skies down over there. Of course, you can't really see it so much in the GoPro, but uh, some better skies come in. Bit of cloud down in the valleys still. That's uh, Penavan over there on the horizon. Eight o'clock. We've been sat in the tent ever since we arrived. We threw it up quickly because it was starting to rain and it's actually hammered it down for about three hours. Uh, so you've not seen the pitch, have you? Let me show, oh, I'm falling over here. Tuffety grass. So here she is. All nice and wet. As you can see, we have porch mode engaged. It's not a bad pitch. It's a bit uh, tuffety. So it stopped raining finally, properly stopped raining now. But uh, the whole place has got really, really wet. We've just been for a bit of a walk. There's a cloud inversion to the west. Been trying to get pictures of it, but uh, we'd have to walk a couple of miles to get close enough, I think, for a good uh, cloud inversion. Yes. I don't know whether you'll be able to see it very well in the GoPro, but I'll show it to you now. So it's over there. I'm not sure what you can see, but 
And it's just the hint of sunset, which is coming soon. And that's the central beacons on the horizon with that cloud leaking through the valley there. Oh, it's lovely here. So peaceful. The wind's completely died. The clouds are going past. It's just lovely. Lynn's in the tent. <laughs> she, she's a bit of a cold soul. And uh, yeah, so she's huddled down. Yeah, it's nice. So there's our neighbours, Welsh ponies, feeding away. Right, I'm going to get back in the tent, I think. Try and warm up. Uh, we were promised sunshine six and seven o'clock tomorrow. Mm -hmm. We're now promised mist and fog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. It's very disappointing after we waited like three extra days yeah. Yeah. to get away from thunderstorms and heavy rain. And, uh, you know. Well, the wind's died, so that's good. Yeah. The wind is you know, supposed to be five or six miles an hour. Mm. It's very so, still at the moment. Yeah, good. Yeah. Might get to sleep. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that'd be a novelty for me. <laughs> it would, yeah. We just realised, didn't we, that mm. we've parked across the sheep trod. Yeah. Let's but hope it's not a horse trod. No. <laughs> There's no sheep up there, no. No. Energy bars, latest batch. Right, last brew of the night. Yeah. So then we'll go to bed. Mm -hmm. Right, we'll finish these then. Mm -hmm. And then um, we'll go to bed, I think. Yeah. So we'll say good night. Yeah, good night. And um, we'll see you what is in our morning. Mm -hmm. And for you, I don't know, just a fade to black, fade back up, that'll be us. <laughs> see you later. Good morning. Well, as you can see, it's pretty claggy this morning. Uh, all the ridges are soaked in. But this is the valley this morning. So we have an inversion with odd bits sticking out of it. How about that? That is pretty. We'll do one more sweep. Isn't that nice? Having said that, mine it is very, very cold. So, uh, didn't have the best night's sleep, to be honest. My hip, oh, hang on. I should probably not do this while trying to walk up Turfity Grass, shouldn't I? Yeah, my hip got cold and I just could not get it warm. I don't know what was going on. But uh, well, I don't think my sleeping bag is the best. The tent is absolutely sodden inside and out because, well, we're camping in a cloud. <laughs> it rained for three hours. Uh, there was a bit of a wind as well, which has just come up. It was like dead still all night. And uh, yeah, not great. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. You're good. You're good. Best thing to have on a cold morning. Mm -hmm. I'm starting to dip here. <coughs> That's better. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, why do we do this? For the views. The views and the exercise. Oh, I've got this towel in my face. <laughs> Oh, this isn't as good as a teaspoon for getting the yogurt out of the bottom. It's not. <laughs> is it? No. Yeah. We haven't shown them our new spoons and forks and stuff, have they? They're a bit, um... <laughs> <laughs> What's the word? <laughs> They're a bit teamy, is what they are. <laughs> <laughs> Very teamy. So, I'll just let you know. <laughs> it's more of a laugh than anything else, to oh. be honest. But, how do they go together? Right. So, you get a knife fork and a spoon, right? And then the knife comes out from underneath. Come sa. <laughs> fork <laughs> and a spoon. Lovely. What was it, one twenty five from Timu or something? Well I can't remember what I actually bought from Timu. But 
it was like you got to spend 10 10 pounds. quid, isn't it? Yeah. So I added this on. Add the two of them on. And yeah, add two of these and... They're very gender Pacific. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a bit genderized. <laughs> That's true. But, well, I'll yeah. give you the pink one. I don't know if the mic's picking up skylarks. <laughs> That's a bit frustrating. It was a bit, wasn't it? <laughs> so we just got packed up. Yeah. Just about to take the tent down, it started raining. Never mind. We'll just sit it out and wait. It shouldn't shouldn't rain for very long. And if it does, well we'll wait for a long time. <laughs> ah dear, never mind. survived another night then yeah ah okay well we're all packed up ready to go no trace apart from a dry bit the valley below is completely now filled with with cloud absolute wonderful all the way around just the big hill sticking out the top okay. yeah so i'm going to find a hat yeah some gloves some gloves and we'll wander on yeah, okie doke. Down into the clag, no doubt. Yeah. But, uh, never mind. It's clearing, I think, over that side. Yeah. Good luck. Okay, talk to you in a bit. Nous allons. Mes enfants. All that stuff. <laughs> ah. Into the clag. Yeah. You're going to say hello to the horsey. Right, but No? Don't want to talk. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We've uh, just walked along the path that follows the escarpment going west and you get to the where there's this fence here and you do a left and now we're hand, heading down the Grinivar Valley and we soon uh, start picking up the the stream that runs down into the reservoir, maybe have a rest. It's only half past seven, so uh, yeah, surrounded by skylarks singing and a lot of water, a lot of water. Luckily this path's been uh, remade in the last couple of years, so uh, easy walking. Quite a way down into the valley now and this is where two streams normally join together. We've got an extra one today, coming straight down out of that hill. You're just gonna have to have wet feet, I think. Yeah. Oh, that, <laughs> that moved that one, didn't it? Yeah. I won't tread on that one then. Tread on that one. Well, as you can see, it's pretty wet on this path. Everything's draining into this valley, of course, and oh, every so often it sort of runs along the path for a, a bit and then flies off down towards the stream. It makes for pretty tricky walking at times. So we're coming down to a place where I've camped once or twice down here next to the stream. I won't show exactly where it is because I want to keep it to myself, obviously. But it's down this valley somewhere. Back down by the reservoir now. Gurwini Val Reservoir. So approaching, getting somewhere handy for the car. Dry pair of socks. What's surprising me is that the reservoir is nowhere near full after all this rain that we've had over months. Let me just show you. You can see there, there's that tiny bothy. Here's the reservoir. But you can see it's a good several feet 
below its high level. So maybe the Welsh have been using too much water. Who knows? Anyway, we'll have a five minutes at the, at the dam and then we'll walk on down to the car and get ourselves off to somewhere for coffee. Linda has been walking through mud. <laughs> and slipping now and again. Can't take her anywhere, can you? We were hoping to go on the dam, but as you can see there, it's all boarded off. There's a crane on the far end and what looks like a satellite. I'm guessing that's probably a camera. It's got a antennae on it. We could go around and have a look, but it's a horrible muddy way to get there, so we're not going to do that. So there you go, can't go on the dams. We're getting close to the car now. We are, not far to go. Not far, so we'll, uh, we'll say goodbye here. Hope you've enjoyed it. Give her the like button a tickle. <laughs> That'd be nice. Apparently it really helps the channel, at least that, that's what everybody says. Yeah, hopefully. Who am I to <laughs> deny them? Yeah. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Yeah, thank you. And we we'll hope to see you in the next one. Bye. Bye bye. Enjoy that? I did, yeah. Surprisingly, I did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a good one.